Good morning, guys. We are here in Chiang Mai, Thailand. We are walking around today, seeing if we can't explore some beautiful, beautiful Thai temples, eat at some amazing restaurants, and drink coffee at some fantastic cafes. So stick with us today as we explore this beautiful, beautiful city and see what it has to offer. The first thing on the docket for today is to get ourselves a motorbike rental. We are gonna to go to Bamboo Bikes. Uh, they got some good reviews on Google, so let's go get ourselves a bike so that we can explore this amazing city. We've been walking along these streets for about five minutes now, and. I just love the way that Chiang Mai is laid out. There are these massive, massive streets with like big stores and apartment buildings and it feels very modern. And then you go down into a street like this and uh, the street's very narrow and there's many more houses and local shops and restaurants and people selling, you know, street food and other things. So just the way that the city is set up, it just feels so amazing to, to walk through. Uh, I think we're about five minutes away from our scooter and I can't wait to see what it's like actually driving here. Just wrapped up here at uh, Bamboo Bikes. It's an awesome place to get a bike. The bike was really cheap as the last one. Uh, it was 200 baht and they have like a really nice policy where if you get a scratch or anything, uh, you don't have to pay a lot and I actually trust them on it. So it's really nice. Uh, we got this bike. So I think the first thing that we're gonna do on the docket today is we're going to go to the Arboretum, which is on the way up to Doi Sutep. So a lot of people just go up there. We're just gonna go to the Arboretum, walk around and enjoy the nature a little bit because it's still early this morning and it's an absolutely gorgeous day. I got this stylish green helmet and it's the only helmet that I've found here that actually fits my massive head. So let's hop on the bike and away we go. We just made it to the Arboretum. It was a fantastic, easy 10 minute drive over here from the center of Chiang Mai. And uh, we're in this beautiful, beautiful forest with these towering trees. Uh, they actually have signs on all of the plants so that you can tell what they are. Um, so this one is, uh, well, it's that. Um, <laughs> but uh, this is a huge park and it's really sprawling. So we're just gonna take, uh, take our time here, relax, and uh, just wait a little bit longer before uh, we start going out. It's Saturday, so a lot of things are open right now. The botanical garden here is quite beautiful. Uh, there's over 250 species of um, just different plants here, which is really nice to see. And there's lots of informational plaques all over the park. Uh, there's a few places for recreation and a really beautiful walking path that kind of meanders through everything. So a really nice place to come in the morning if you want to go on a little jog or get just some, just some walking in. Uh, it's really nice to just be able to step right off the side of the road and be in this really beautiful big uh, park. Here it is one more time from the outset. I'm just going to go out and get some breakfast right now. We saw a cute little place uh, on the way over here. So we're just going to hop back on the scooter and head over for breakfast. really cute dumpling place from the side of the road so we are just here pulled over at stupid fries I think it's called um, weird name but uh, here it is here's the menu and uh, they have a really cute little mural and uh, a really really cute little restaurant area so we're just gonna get some dumplings Kailani's gonna eat I am intermittent fasting so that means that I don't eat um, for most of the day and I get all my food from 12.30 to 6.30 so I'm gonna wait a little bit to eat but uh, we're gonna hang out while Kailani gets some dumplings before we go on to our next stop. finished up her little breakfast and now we're gonna hop back on the bike go back to the uh, the old part of town the square part uh, and then we're going to uh, just cruise around some neighborhoods get to know the city a little bit before we go off and have some lunch and for lunch today we're gonna treat ourselves we're gonna get some cow soy which is the traditional North Thai food Yeah. All right, 
right, so that was like the cutest thing that we've ever seen. There's this huge dance competition going on right now in the Maya Mall, and uh, there was probably, oh God, I don't know, like six or seven different troops of these amazing uh, little hip hop dancers. They were probably like, I don't know, five to 10 years old. They were absolutely crushing it. So really fun to see here at Maya Mall. Every single story of the whole place was everyone's just cheering and, and watching them go. So always something going on here. All right, we just went into Daiso, which was kind of like a Japanese uh, little mini mark. And since I'm going to Tokyo tomorrow, I decided to get some snacks for the plane. I got some sour candies and I got these milk candies here at Daiso in the Maya Mall. Couldn't doesn't get any better than that. And look, we're at the top floor and we see more people practicing their dance off. <laughs> That's so cute. All right, so we just got back on the bikes. We were walking around in the Maya Mall and lo and behold, we saw that they were showing the new Avatar, The Way of Water. So we, we stopped in, I got some popcorn, I got a huge drink. And uh, yeah, we just were spending the last three hours in there. So we still haven't had lunch. We are gonna go get cow soy. So now we're getting on the bike and then we're gonna go do that same cow soy spot that we were going to earlier, except now uh, it's dinner time. So we're gonna go get some dinner. We're gonna go to the night market after we get that cow soy and that's gonna call it for our night here in Chiang Mai. So let's get back on the bike and we'll see you back in the old district uh, for some cow soy. start off the night with a nice healthy smoothie. Uh, Kailani got this lychee juice which he is kind enough to let me share and it's just like mm. it's just juiced lychee there's nothing else in there it's fantastic. I got a banana and strawberry smoothie and I'm gonna go pick it up and then we're gonna keep walking around. That was the Saturday night market here in Chiang Mai. I got that cow soy that I've been wanting all day and it was fantastic. Uh, cow soy is like a curry based coconut uh, soup with uh, egg noodles and fried egg noodles on top. It's fantastic. It has a little bit of a crunch that you wouldn't usually get with noodles. Uh, it was just amazing. It filled me up. I got a little smoothie. Uh, and now we're just headed back to uh, return the bike and to call it a day for today. Tomorrow I'm on a plane. Uh, to Bangkok and then I'm waiting the whole day in the Bangkok airport 12 hours uh, and then I'm meeting up with my friend in Tokyo so thanks so much guys for hanging out with us today as we explore Chiang Mai uh, please if you like the video and you want to see more stuff like this uh, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel I come out with new videos all the time uh, and uh, yeah thanks so much for being with us here today and I'll see you guys in the next one